technology guys if you're looking to uh, mirror your window screen onto your Android phone then it is possible but you're going to need to use a piece of software so let's go to the Play Store here now I'm mirroring my phone onto the screen here so you can see what I'm doing a lot more easier so we're going to go to the Google Play Store and download uh, Chrome remote desktop software for Android okay so what we're going to do here is download this and what we need to do is then install this onto our Android phone it's pretty straightforward and easy to do now you can use other methods as well to do this this is just one way of doing it but now we've got Chrome remote desktop installed on our uh, mobile phone what we're going to do is open this up and you can see this is the screen uh, that we have got on here now so what we need to do here now okay so now we've got that installed I'm just going to drag this to the side and then what I'm going to do is download the Chrome remote desktop for our Windows PC so let's go to the browser here and just type in here Chrome remote desktop do a search for that and you can see the download link is there so we can add this into our browser so I'm just going to click on this and we'll just let that uh, populate once we click on it and there we go that's just gonna come up now there we go so we've got Chrome remote desktop here we're gonna add this to our browser here so click add it's just gonna check and then start to download and install this to our browser now if you've never used Chrome remote desktop it's a really handy tool for helping out family and friends if they've got problems with their computer there's other uh, a remote software desktop software out there that you can use as well but this is just one that you can use so I'm just going to let that install and once we've got this installed you should see it there on the screen there Chrome remote desktop so click on this now we have a couple of options open to us here we have remote assistance if you need assistance you can click on that one but we're going to go to my computers access your own computer click on enable remote connections and accept and install this will install the uh, Chrome remote desktop host installer and remember this is going to be on your Windows machine okay now a couple of boxes may open and then what we're going to do is click on run and this will then download and install uh, the Chrome remote desktop host uh, file so we're going to let that download say yes to the user account control and let that install now once we've got that done we can enable remote connection up will pop this box and you will now get a pin so we need to add in our pin here and this will be the pin that you're going to use for your Android device as well so I'm going to give this a pin and retype the pin there and click OK and it will enable remote connection from this computer up will pop the user account control say yes to this and remote connections from this computer have been enabled now you should see your icon down the bottom for your desktop computer which has been enabled here as you can see now go over to your Android phone click on the Chrome remote desktop and you should see your desktop icon here which means it's ready to connect click on this icon here and it should start to connect put in the same pin that you set up on your Windows machine and it will start to connect now once you get a connection it may take a second or so and there you go we now have a connection from our Windows to our Android phone and it will broadcast everything from your Windows to your Android phone it's that simple it's pretty straightforward now let me just show you what this looks like uh, in a real world so not in a virtual world here where you can see I'm broadcasting my phone to the desktop screen here I'll show you what it looks like on the actual phone itself so you can actually see that it has connected this is just me sharing my phone to uh, my Windows machine so I can show you both of them in the same uh, time here so let me just quickly show you uh, my phone and there you go you can see my Windows is on here I can move it about so I can control my Windows machine from my Android phone click on the browser icon and open up the browser and there we go we've got full control of our Windows machine from our Android phone and you should get all that displayed on there now you can also uh, browse the full screen by scrolling across by just scrolling across here like so and because it's on a very small screen you're going to be hard to see the whole screen but 
And of course, this is a great way to access your Windows machine from your Android phone. If you want to get hold of documents or pictures or anything like that, you can access it via this method. It's very easy to do and it's very quick. As you can see here, you've got full control and full access of that Windows machine from your phone. And uh, this will work on any Android device. Anyway, that's pretty much it. That's how you can mirror your Windows machine to an Android phone. My name is Brian from brightechcomputers.co.uk. Now this was a video request by someone who left a comment saying how would you uh, broadcast your Windows desktop onto an Android phone and that's pretty much one way of doing it. Anyway, thanks again for watching guys. Have a great day and I shall see you again for another video real soon. Bye for now. Now if you haven't subscribed yet, hit the big red subscribe button on my YouTube channel and hit the bell notification button next to that to be notified when we upload new videos.